Hi there! This is a quick update video on House of the Dragon spy photos. Audio only. I'm not going to show them. Because unlike previous spy photos, which were exterior reports, people on a public beach managed to sneak up, take zoomed-in shots of things, a few spy photos came out in the past few days which were blatantly taken from interior sets the only possible way they came out is that a crew member violated their NDA agreement to snap something with their iPhone. So, this is all a game. It's all in the game. This dance we have with Warner Brothers and HBO of, okay, we try to sneak things that are out in the open. But actually smuggling a camera inside with a crew member, these are people who signed NDA agreements. So, we can't show that, and I had a long discussion with this, actually, as these were coming out, with uh, other fan channels, House of the Dragon Brazil, and the House of the Dragon Greece channel, that we share these images through private message, but publicly, we had already decided as soon as they came out, you know, we have seen this happening before, that no, there is a difference between you film this as an exterior thing, and... A crew member violated an NDA agreement. We can't share this. So we already decided, and I already accepted before anything happened, do not post this publicly. And they actually, since then, have been posting takedowns on Reddit and Twitter when people try to post these. Even House of the Dragon Brazil said, I'm, they posted it up and said, after an hour, I'm going to take this down. I'm not even comfortable putting this on Twitter. There were actually only really two things. One was a short video clip, but it was nothing. It might as well have been a still image. It, it was of what seemed to be the, an interior chamber of the Red Keep, but it could have been any castle for all we know, to be honest. The only thing of note was that there was like a, a big decorative seven-pointed star. And it looked like the Red Keep, but it could plausibly have been any castle, like Casterly Rock or something. So... I wouldn't have reported on that anyway, because it was so vague as to be meaningless. And that happened like uh, four or five days ago, we got that. Right after that, though, we got one actual image of merit. But I, I realized even when I saw this, I can't repost this. I shouldn't. For that matter, I don't need to. Well, after all that buildup, a crew member violated an NDA agreement to apparently take a photo of the blue screen room. And in the blue screen room, we saw two dragon saddle rigs. Not just a blue screen rig for a dragon that Amelia Clark sits on. We've seen things like that. It had an actual dragon saddle on it. Which is big news for us, because every video, or every second video, someone is always in the comments going, Damn it, are they going to have dragon saddles this time? Because it was an error in the original show that Daenerys needs to have a goddamn saddle, otherwise she'll fall off the dragon. I mean, more so than a horse, that dragons are flying around, there's G-forces that you don't have with a horse, and sometimes they, ro they bank and roll, that you can't just hang on to the horns, that's silly. Now, by the end of Season 5, this wasn't a problem, like, the point where she jumps onto the dragon when it's in the gladiator pit... That happens in the books, too. It's, you wouldn't expect it to have a saddle then. She didn't expect to ride it. But around season seven-ish, by the time she's already with her army again, it got upsetting to people that she should have commissioned a saddle for this thing. Is it just that they kind of forgot? And that was a meme going around, that Benioff kind of forget that you need a saddle? Was there some sort of internal discussion that, no, a saddle won't look cool? I lean more towards that they just plain forgot, but why would you... What possible argument is there against a saddle? Maybe they thought that the chains wrapping around the dragon's chest would look weird compared to that, but you need a saddle and it's wrapped around the dragon like that. So I'm not posting this spy photo for two reasons. That As I decided with the Brazil and Greece channels, this is violating an NDA agreement. This goes too far. All is fair in love and war when we, you know, snag spy photos on a public beach. 
this is something taken from an interior. It's from the blue screen set on top of that. This isn't even something like, okay, it's Leavesden, but we zoomed in on like the castle sets they're building in the back lot. This goes beyond that. So to avoid legal repercussions, I'm not going to post it, one. Point two, I don't need to repost it. You know what a saddle looks like. Like, I don't need to show it to you. I will say there, was, there weren't discernible designs or heraldry on them. It's just a saddle. The one thing I'll say is that they had high backs to them, and they were on a dragon-shaped blue screen rig. But that makes sense. That They are going so fast, you need to have a higher back on the thing to hold you up. I mean, if it was a horse saddle, it wouldn't really make as much sense. Well, actually, two things about it. First, it's a saddle. It's pretty high-backed. Second thing is, there are two of them right next to each other. Not, I don't mean two on the same dragon. I mean, there's two dragon-shaped blue screen objects, you can tell this is a blue screen dragon, which are positioned about 10 feet apart from each other, parallel, and each of these blue dragon blobs has a saddle on it. So, like, if Rhaenyra is riding on Cyrax while Daemon is riding next to her on Caraxes, they can look back and forth at each other. That We didn't really have or need that in Game of Thrones. I mean... Jon Snow rode Rhaegal maybe once or twice where he'd actually plausibly be next to Daenerys on Drogon, but other than that, you didn't need that. Versus, and not just Caraxes and Cyrax, what if, like, her sons are riding next to each other or moon dancers with them or something? So they thought out, we're actually going to have the goddamn dragon saddles as they're described in the books, and it was getting increasingly unrealistic that Maybe they just thought the dragons didn't look cool if they had chains on them to hold the damn saddle on. But it was getting ridiculous, particularly when Daenerys makes that stupid white hunt rescue and everyone holds on to the back. Like a whole squad of people. They're never used like that in the books. Rarely they have a second person hanging on the back like a motorcycle rider. You hang on to the person who's in the saddle. And that's even that is rare. That they're not a helicopter gunship. You can't do that. The, the, the dragons are sensitive about even having another person on them who isn't their rider, and they trust their rider enough that if you're holding the rider, hugging them from behind, you can kind of do it. Whatever. So, I why would I need to post the image of this just to excite people and incur the wrath of HBO? And in case HBO is scanning for this, which we actually know they are, this is already public news, it's all over social media, it's all over Reddit, so I'm just verbally describing public information that, yeah, we saw some dragon saddles, there really isn't much more to say about it. And it's a nice little thing, because everyone keeps asking about that, about, are they going to have the damn saddles this time? Because fundamentally, my channel isn't relying on what... I'm talking about Screen Rant, what they do. If, oh my god, this is a spy photo. It's, you've seen this for months. I don't just go, hey, here's a spy photo. I then pick it apart and analyze it in detail because I have read and comprehend the books and I am endlessly analyzing small details. Like, I have a whole thing just on their currency system, cross-referenced. So it's not just, and here's another photo of a different thing. Like, we know that. I'll, like, I'll post a photo if I go, oh, here's another angle of Alice and Hightower from behind. Notice that the lacing is up the, the middle of the back instead of the sides. We thought it was the other way around for, like, costuming details. That if you try to rely on just spy photos, anyone can do that, and it's going to make WB and HBO mad at you. This isn't really sustainable compared to long-form analysis, and this is the type of clickbait thing that destroyed late Game of Thrones, when people are going, oh my god, there's certainly a fireball somewhere around the Winterfell set, when they should have been having discussions about, dear god, the Sansa rape didn't make, wasn't made up for in later seasons, or how are there only six episodes, when people were just, oh my god, here's a spy photo of Maisie Williams clearly doing something, and there was never a wrong answer, because it was just a photo. Because anyone can do that. There's too much competition. So as we rebuild this, it, it helps that actually WB is weeding out when we're just circulating these things on social media, that Screen Rant can't just post stupid... They did this with the teaser trailer. They had no idea what they were talking about. 
that you can't just rely on the images, you have to have something to say about them. So going forward, I'm trying to play the game we all are. We've all discussed that this is why you're not seeing big reports from the Portuguese fan sites, the Greek ones we've all we were discussing this on Instagram. That no, we want we genuinely want to work with the studio, but and if you're going, oh well, I'm promoting the show, no. Even if they tolerate us, it is rude in a way that will insult them, regardless of whether you know, we think it's fair. You, it's an unspoken rule. You don't report on spy photos that are so blatantly a cameraman violated an NDA agreement to share this. That it, it, It's a dance we have, like a press conference with the studio, that we need to be able to do that. So yes, dragons have saddles in House of the Dragon. And I hope this means that we're going to see stuff like that. We'll see this in the trailer, obviously, when we start seeing dragons, that they will have saddles on them. Otherwise, the main, the main channels like House of the Dragon Brazil, the other ones, Portal Brazil, we're not going to share videos and photos that we can tell this is beyond the pale someone snapped a really bad photo of the, uh, you you shouldn't have been able to sneak in like this you violated an nda agreement that we're trying to play by the rules to work with hbo to promote this within reason and they know yeah if it's on a public beach we can probably snap a photo of that it's all in the game <laughs>